Right, um, what is happening here at Bedbridge is uh, the commissioning of a uh, Red Safe uh, Center, uh, which is basically responsible for uh, handling uh, migrants who flee from their respective countries or who migrate uh, to other countries in search of uh, other persons. So basically what we're saying is a center for access and information, for restoring family links, and you know for uh, keeping safe their documents and information. Information is aid. Now, there is quite great demand for these other services offered uh, through the Red Safe and restoration of family links. Apart from the one in Bedbridge, we, we do have one in Harare at the road ports, we have another one in Chipinge uh, at the Tongo Gara refugee camp and another one in Bulawayo. So basically these are the uh, four centers that we currently have but with an average of about 500 migrants being saved every month. So the, uh, around 200 people were being saved because the information flow was not yet uh, available. So with the current setup that we now have information uh, available, with a couple of this information dissemination, we are now saying about 500 patients. Uh, migrants, so to speak, and this number is expected to increase to about a thousand in a month or two. Charging box, right? Um, Where we take all the charging the phones of those people and saving so that they can be charged here. We know that as you are, as you are moving, right? Some phones can get shut, shut down, so that's what we are saying. So, if any phones shut down while well, they are coming here, right? We took the day, those phones and we charged them so that they can get. And we offer free phone calls, three three minutes phone calls to those who are moving. So those with the problem they can come here and offer them three three minutes phone calls. We offer our Wi-Fi vouchers. Those vouchers, those those who are there with social media, Facebook, WhatsApp, we give them three three minutes, three thirty minutes Wi-Fi vouchers so they can get in touch with their families. We have a Center will be will help us a lot, and uh, we're very much we are very much happy about it and excited as well because it has come at the right time. Uh, we have got people who become stranded here in our border, as you know, it's a border town. This one, they come from Somalia, some come from Egypt, and so forth. When they are stranded here or their particulars are stolen, they've got no way to go. So it will need the. We, this center to help us as it has come and they will leave, fully use it because they have got such people who roam about uh, failing to contact their relatives at home or their friends abroad. So we are very happy about this center.